Hey yo, what's up my little holders? Let's solve today the lead code question 1051, the hey checker. So, the task is the following. Students are asked to stand in non-decreasing order of height for an annual photo. Return the minimal number of students that must move in order for all students to be standing in non-decreasing order of height. Notice that when a group of students is selected, they can reorder in any possible way between themselves and the non-selected students remain on their seats. So here's the example, like we have this input array. After that, as you can see, there should be like some steps taken. Person four should solve this person one, blah, 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 and so on. But simply speaking, we just need to, to calculate how many people are standing on the wrong places. So basically, for example, we have a sorted array, the proper one, which we should get in the end, if everyone stands correctly. You can just compare each value of, of the given array with the sorted array. And just in case, if, if there is no, if we don't have a match, we just like increment our counter. So let's do that. So let's create a sorted array. Um, which is equal to hate.clone. So we need to clone the, the input array. We cannot do just something like this, like that. Otherwise, the sorted array would point to the input array. And in this case, if you sort the sorted array after that, then the hate array will be sorted as well. So we want to, to clone this array. Um, let's just use the building function to sort it. Um, so let's create our counter, which will increment every time when we don't see a match. So we need to inter iterate through every single value in the input array, for example. And in case, if two of the values from the sorted array and the input array don't match, we want to increment our counter. So if they don't match, counter gets incremented and then we can just return the counter simply as that perfect hmm only 43 must be a bug okay here we go yeah lead code is sometimes quite weird in giving the precise um, space complexity, like this, the space complexity result or the time complexity result. Sometimes it depends on internet or something like that. Uh, but yeah, here we go. It was lead code problem number 1051. Thank you guys. And please subscribe to this channel to not miss a lot of videos which are going to come soon. Thank you.